Pane Pori. Hey, welcome back to our Super Directions TV. It's up Corbin. I'm Alex. My guy. Ashley. Rick. And you can follow us on Instagram and Twitter. Oh, it's so juicy. For more spicy noodle content. Yeah. yeah. And it'll from, be driven from the uh, video title, you see what we are doing. Uh, this got recommended to me on Twitter. Uh, somebody said, Corbin, you should try these. And I said, what, ramen noodles? <laughs> Apparently not. Uh, these are called Maggie uh, Two Minute Noodles, Authentic Indian Noodles. Masala spicy. Oh, they're spicy? Whoa. So, uh, apparently these are like a staple. Yeah, like, this is the noodle that Indrani eats, like, regularly while I'm talking I about I went it. to the store, it was the first shelf, and it was all full, and uh, yep. there were like three people in the line in front of me, and all of them... Yeah, I guess this is the ramen noodle of India. Yeah. Because in America, ramen noodles are the... Well, then I asked them, uh, I said, are these ramen noodles? They said, well, it, they are ramen noodles if ramen noodles weren't bland. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, okay. shots fired! Uh, so, wow. but and then here's a little uh, synopsis of them. Oh my! I'm ready. Maggie is liquid gold. Maggie well. is curry flavored magic. My childhood in a bowl. Maggie is perfect when soupy. Perfect sans broth. Sans broth. Perfect even straight out of the fridge. Uh, what Maggie is is this: a brick of instant noodles that you crack in half over boiling water, then cook with the flavored powder that looks like straight up turmeric and tastes like 200% of your dadium sodium intake. <laughs> <laughs> so similar to ramen. Right, yeah. right? But I think this is gonna pack some heat. Yeah. Pack some heat and with the Indian flair and flavor. Too. Yes. So I'll, we're, I'm gonna do a little quick cooking of it. Looks like it should just take two minutes. This is gonna make you wanna do a Bollywood dance number. Over the toilet, maybe. <laughs> you're a child and can't handle anything. <laughs> yeah, we, I think we all agree, uh, it smells like what ramen we know noodles. as ramen noodles, which I'm sure you know as well. With uh, just a little bit of curry. Yeah, and so it smells like it has a little bit of uh, Indian masala, oh, something, right? Something. Mm. Oh, something, something. So uh, let's just uh, dig in here. It's gonna be hot. It's I'm, really hot. I'm digging in two Ooh. ways. The first way is in honor of Indrani, because she eats hers with two forks. It was nice and day. Yeah, but it's not bad. You know, my ramen noodles, I don't like with the, the soup. I like yeah, it. I just like the noodles. Yeah, I, I, don't, I don't like to have the soup. It's just it's like, like, honestly... Ramen noodles with like a little something in there. spicy ramen noodles. Yep, and now the Italian way. It's pretty good. Yep. Not a lot of spice in there. Personally, I feel like it tastes like ramen noodles. I don't think it's more I feel like it would taste better if you made it the way you did. Yeah, how do, you, how do you normally make your... You do the noodles and the water, and then you set that, you put that in a bowl, and then you put the spice on it. Yeah, I, yeah. I feel like that's what a lot of people do, because that makes the flavor stronger. Yeah. Mm -hmm. um, so maybe, Great. yeah, I drain the water out, we were set for a very little bit, Yeah, and then put the seasoning in, so it's strong. Yeah, we were told to put the seasoning in the water uh, mm -hmm. from the packet. Right. And so that's what we did. Which I think is what ramen noodles does. Yeah. We also put soy sauce in our ramen. Yeah, I mean, that's what ramen says to do. Yeah, our, our ramen, ramen says put it in the water. Yeah, but we make it where you pour we most of the water out. Way. Yeah, but I, this is definitely basically from what we know as Indian ramen noodles. That's what you would call these, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Basically, it's I like call it spicy ramen noodles. Yeah, it's the exact same type of noodle with a little noodles. bit of spice. Yeah. I don't think it tastes it's any different. It's barely any spice. I don't even taste very much spice no. in there. Um, yeah, I, I mean, I would I eat this. Like, I want to try it the way we do. 
to see what to see what the actual we flavor don't is have like. any. It's more. good. <laughs> um, but you can let us know how you eat it. How do you make it? It's tasty. Are you talking? Oh, I thought you were talking to Rick. No. <laughs> how do you make Just, it? Mr. Sucker, Mr. Babies. Yeah, but people make ramen different, like everywhere. Yeah. Yeah, I'm, and my bet is that Indians are like, yeah, we do this, but then we also add like tons and tons of spices on yeah. top of it, like to make it like fancy ramen. Do you have ramen? There? That's what we do. One of the best ramens I've ever had, this will come as no surprise, was in the airport in Shanghai. Oh, then we get. Oh, uh, come yeah. On. Yeah, yeah, it was like, oh, next level. The yeah. best ramen I've ever had was New York, New York City. Like, oh, oh that, was, that was, that was awesome. Ramen. That was the best ramen. Yeah. Oh. Well, that, I think we can all agree it's tasty. Very tasty. Very tasty. Very tasty. Very uh, let us know what else, uh, if there's stuff that we have here before we come to India that we yeah. can try. I'm gonna name mine. What? AR. AR. <laughs> AR ramen. Mm. Bada ching. Thank you very much. 